315 employees of finally understand that can donate 24,478.40 dollars to the Red Cross. What was average donation? Run to the nearest cent. So when we have to find the average donation and we have given number of employees and the total donation, what we have to do? We have to divide total donation by number of employees. So donation was a little bit about, about dollar symbol. We have twenty four four seven eight decimal point four zero divided by how many employees we have three hundred fifteen. We have to do long division. Our divisor is whole number, so we can set long division. We have three fifteen. 2, 4, 4, 7, 8, decimal point 40. So let's do this. How many times 315 goes to 2447? 7 times. 7 times 315 is 2205. Now we have to do subtraction. 7 minus 5 is 2, 4 minus 0 is 4, 4 minus 2 is 2, 2 minus 2 is 0, we don't have to write. What next? We have to take down next digit and we have now 2428 divided by 315, so it will be also 7. 7 times 315 is 2, 205, subtraction, 8 minus 5 is 3, 2 minus 0 is 2, 4 minus 2 is 2, 2 minus 2 is 0. What next? We have to take up decimal point exactly in the same column and we take next digit down. So we have 4. So we have 2234 divided by 315. So it will be 7. 7 times 315 is 2, 2, oh, 5, subtraction, again, 4 minus 5 we cannot do, so we will borrow 1 from 3, so it will be 2, and at the end 14, 14 minus 5 is 9, 2 minus 0 is 2, 2 minus 2 will be 0, we don't have to write what next, we will take down next digit, is 0, so we have 290 divided by 350 is 0. We have to run our solution to the nearest cent. So we need to have three digits after our decimal point. One, why three digits? Because the second digit will be hundred, so this is, will be our cent, and we need one extra digit to do rounding. So our dividend, in our dividend, we will have to add one more zero. So let's finish now multiplication. Zero times 315 is zero. So subtraction. So we have 290. We have to take down next zero. So we have 2,900 divided by 315, it will be 9. 9 times 315 is 2835. Again, subtraction we have to do. 0 minus 5 we cannot do, so we have to borrow 1 from next digits, but we have 0. So we have to treat these two digits like whole number. We have 90 minus 1, so it will be 89. And now at the end we will have 10. 10 minus 5 is 5. 9 minus 3 is 6. 8 minus 8 is 0. So we don't have to write. So we have 65 our reminder. And what else? Because we need to round our solution to the nearest cent, like I said. So we need only three digits in our solution after decimal point. Because hundredth place will tell is our cent place. So we need one extra digit to do the rounding. So at that moment we can stop long division. We don't need 
to do long division anymore and we got 77.709 like I said because we need to run to the nearest cent so we need to underline the place of hundredth is the second digit after decimal point and what next we have to do we check the number which is after our underlying digits is nine when we have number greater than five or five we have to add one to our underlying digits and what else every digits after our underlying digits we have to change to zero so we have will be zero and now zero plus one is one and wherever we have before our underlying digits we have to copy so our solution will be 77 decimal point 71. Of course, we have to add dollars. So we got 77 dollars 71 cents. This was average donation. This is my solution.